This video is sponsored by EA. The thunderous V1 and JB2 flying bombs can stop an enemy offensive cold in Battlefield 5. They're one of many reinforcement options in a squad leader's arsenal. If you're not a squad leader, there are a couple of ways to take command in Battlefield 5. First, open your comma rows and request an order. Unless an order is active or issued quickly, you'll soon find yourself promoted to squad leader. Alternatively, you can create your own squad in game, but you'll gain requisition points much quicker in a full squad. Requisition points are earned by playing the objective and supporting your team. They're also what allow you to call in reinforcements. Mark objectives to attack or defend with the spot button via the comma rows. You'll earn requisition points as a reward if these orders are carried out by squad mates. You can also earn requisition points by tossing out medical pouches to wounded teammates as a medic or resupplying players as a support. Reviving players and building fortifications also piles on the requisition points and even spawning on squad mates nets you a few. The total number of requisition points you have shows up next to your name in the squad. To spend your hard-earned requisition points, open up the reinforcement menu by holding the B key on PC or by holding grenade and spot buttons simultaneously on console. To select the V1 or JB2 flying bombs, you will need 41,500 requisition points. And when selected, you'll find yourself equipped with a set of binoculars to mark the target location. Try to pick a location like a choke point or where enemies tend to cluster. Remember that flying bombs do take a few seconds to arrive, so consider where players are likely to be in the near future. If you still have doubts, contested flags are always a good bet. For more Battlefield 5 videos, visit youtube.com slash flagfiregaming. Thanks for watching.